skill two, cloning a repository using RStudio. First thing I need to do is get the URL of the repository I want to clone. So I'm going to go to repositories, go to test, copy that URL. Now I'm going to open RStudio, go up in the top corner here, say new project, version control, git, paste in the URL. There we go. Make sure it's in the right place. As I said in the workshop, you always want your Git repositories in the same place, not mixed in with other things. It'll save you a lot of headaches. There we go. Now I've cloned it. If I go into this directory, you will see that there is now a folder called test. Now one comment about using the um, using Git from RStudio. Uh, my uh, RStudio is already set up, and if you haven't used Git with RStudio yet, you may need to alter things. So if you click on Tools, I'm not sure you can see that. I don't think you can see my toolbar. Well, no, maybe you can. So you're gonna click on Tools and go to Global Options. And then this git svn. So there are two things that you need to specify. Uh, well, first you have to say enable version control. Then you need to tell it where the git executable is. If you're on a Mac, that's pretty simple. It's just this user bin git. If you're on a PC, there's a few different places where it could be. See the setup notes for the workshop website. To find it. Okay, and that that's basically it for cloning. When you're cloning, you're not going to need to do authentication. So you don't have to give it your um, username and password in order to clone a repository. But when we get to pushing information up to a repository, we will need to uh, go through authentication, and I'll call, cover that in a separate video.